this wave and then okay this is a binary up down counter uh, we have taken three flip flops here so it is expected to count up from 0 to 7 uh, down from 7 to 0 and we are using these uh, flip flops here j and k are tied to 1 so all j's are connected to vcc and k is connected to an interactive high voltage and we are using uh, two circuits here two and gates followed by an or gate two and gates and followed by an or gate there is a clock here we have given a 10 hertz signal of a square wave now these two and gates the inputs to these two and, and gates are one is coming from q for this gate one of the inputs is coming from q bar the other input is connected by means of an inverter okay so this inverter input this is an inverter this is the input side this is the output side if you give 0 here, this output is going to be 1. If you give 1, the output is going to be 0. So now as you can see, one input is anyway coming from Q. The other input is coming from the output of the inverter. So if you give 0 here, that means this is 1. And this is 1 and this is 1. This AND gate output is going to be 1. Independent of what this output is, this output is connected to the R gate. So the output, because this gate is high, this even if it is 1 or 0, this output is going to be high. If this is high, this clock is high and it will send a high signal here. And because of this coming, the same signal is coming here, same input is coming here, this is going to be high, this is going to be high, this is going to be high and this is high. So that means if this is 0, the upper gates are enabled and this counter counts it as an up counter. Likewise, if it is 1, that means the input is 1, this is 0, so the 0 is connected, this is 1, so the 1 is connected here and the 0 goes here. So upper gates are now disabled, this is 1, if this is also 1, this gate is 1. As long as R gate is concerned whether the output is, whether the input is coming from this or this, it remains the same, the output is going to be 1. This is 1, this is 1, this is 1. So that means all the lower AND gates are driving this R gate and hence it becomes an uh, down counter. Let us now see. Let me just take 0, switch on. Now this is down counter, 7, 6, 5. At the same time this is going up, this is going down. 3, 4, 2, 5, 1, 6, 0, 7. So this is down, this is up. Same way, let's make this as 1 here. This is down, this is up. So this is how the circuit is working as binary up-down count. How is it?